Next on News Be Funny, the Easter Bunny. Festive fun and games. Delicious candy. All of this and more, starting now. It's not quite 7.30 on Easter morning, and reporter Alan Sanchez is already under pressure. Give him the basket. Oh, oh, oh no. How disturbing. There you go. Oh, no. Oh, there you go. Nightmares now. Oh, there you go. Nightmares. Yeah. Did you notice they're using the bunny system? In the bunny system. Scuba diving school. tank. I'm here all day. Unfortunately. No, just kidding. <laughs> Into Weaster Weekend. Weekend, rather. Low 60s for Saturday. Upper 60s to near 70 on Sunday. And Monday will be into the low 70s with full sunshine. Reporter Melissa Stevens has made the journey from South Bend to be taken on an official tour of the Elkhart Easter egg hunt. Oh, look at this. We have a special guest, everybody. <laughs> we have the Easter Bunny. And, you know, who knows? Maybe, <laughs> maybe you'll see that happen when you're looking for the eggs. <laughs> but, you know, you, you just never know what you're going to see when you're out on the trails. Speaking of the Easter Bunny, is he okay? Is he all right? <laughs> is he doing all right? Uh, I think, well, the eggs are still there, so I... <laughs> He may have a bruised ego. Well, we wish him well, and we will check on his condition and make sure to bring that to you uh, later on today. You know, also put a little little rabbit on your uh, forecast right, there, a little know? Easter bunny. I Easter suppose. bunny and all the yeah. Easter egg hunks out there, hunts out there. As um, yeah, we'll have a big forecast. Yeah, I know. I said hunks. I meant hunt. <laughs> <laughs> Easter hunks. <laughs> oh boy, I'm, yeah, I'm yeah, taking it away. Oh man. Hi, how, how are you? Doing? It's it. Oh, are you having a good Friday today? Yeah, but uh, we're actually on the air. We're on TV. Yeah, thanks. Right now? Yeah, but, uh, thank you. What? Thanks for what? <laughs> what? You know, it just doesn't get any well, better than doing this stuff down here at Fox. <laughs> this no, is live TV, Ed. You're rolling with the punch as well. <laughs> Anyhow, for the past four months, I've been waiting for the Chrysler Concord to come in. Ow, 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 ow. He's pulling his tail. That's the you Easter know. Bunny. You just can't get this type of entertainment on so many networks. I called my friend Bashan Fatty out of Village Chrysler for many, many times back in December because I've been actually waiting on this car. And you're going to see Concords all over the road. Inevitably, it's early evening. And for evening anchor Jack Caudill, it's time for Pet of the Week. Well, if you're looking to have a hair-raising good time, you might want to consider adopting the Humane Society's Pet of the Week, or should we say Pets of the Week. Yes, pets, that's right. This week we're introducing you to two floppy-eared friends, Lopsy and Bee, a pair of bunnies. These seven-year-old companions... <laughs> Jack. Jack, why are you laughing? Okay, there... <laughs> Do I need to take this over, you guys? <laughs> Where are we at? Meaning they both must go to their new home together. It's only 20 bucks for the cuddly companions, and it's almost Easter, so if you're looking for your very own Easter bunny, stop by the Humane Society of the Black Hills and let it hop its way into your heart. Why are you laughing? Something struck me as funny about the name Lopsy. <laughs> I've never I'm seen crying. Jack in tears laughing, so... I think we've peaked, you guys. It's a good name for a bunny. If I had a bunny, I would name it Lopsy. Go get him. Un chocolate. Mira, eh, aguanta. Mira, 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 mira. No tiene una base ahí donde lo da. Aguanta, aguanta, eh. A ver. Oh, mira. Qué bueno. Espera, espera, espera que no. Espera, eh, espera. Oh, oh, no. ¿Cuántos? ¿1.500 hay que poner ahora? No, pero... ¿Quién lo va a pagar eso? Fue una apología. Hay que garparlo que esto ahora, ¿eh? Yo te digo, escúchame, Débora, esto es para sacar el mal gusto de ayer que me quedó el partido de Racing, ¿eh? Mariano, a mí me habían hablado para, realmente pero... de tu habilidad para romper los huevos, pero Ay, nunca papá. pensé, nunca pensé verlo en vivo, realmente. Seven day outlook, uh, big time changes, 66 today for Los Angeles, cooling down to a high of only 63 degrees, and an overnight low dropping down to 40. That's going to happen on Thursday. Starting to clear out Friday and into Saturday. <laughs> Wait a minute. It's the Easter Bunny, man. <laughs> What's up with that? Yeah. Get him out of here. <laughs>
<laughs> it looked more like the Stay Puft Marshmallow Bunny. I know, that is the biggest Easter Bunny on the planet, man. I mean, that is a huge rabbit. Uh, that's a lot. Yeah, look at that. 50. Yeah. Good evening. 53 now degrees will be the daytime high tomorrow. Rain moving into the area basically on Wednesday. And uh, Thursday, we can expect to see some more rain. That's it. Back to you and the uh, Bunny, Frank. All right, Mark. Thank you. Reporter Chris Williams has come to Kilwins in Petoskey to meet Steve Hooley, and something has happened. From Kilwins and Steve, thanks for having Hi, us Chris. in your chocolate factory again. <laughs> we appreciate you it. Hey, it, you guys are hopping around here, really busy. This is crazy for you this time of year. This is a this is a real busy time. Probably our second busiest busiest holiday of the year, right after Christmas and probably right before a Valentine's Day. <laughs> and you start this out. You start working <laughs> right after Valentine's Day, right? I mean, you start early. You bet. You bet. We uh, we have all our our products <laughs> shipped to the uh, to the store by uh, by mid March. So. Uh, and we're just we're just finishing up right now. And you're friends with the Easter Bunny? He is he is without a doubt our best customer. <laughs> in fact, the Easter Bunny's your friend. Steve Upton had to walk over here. Mary Rolls is with us, and Mary, you're working on a giant rabbit here. How big is this guy? This guy is going to be 22 pounds or bigger. <laughs> you do a lot of the. Uh, you do. <laughs> As we're continuing to work on this, have you seen? <laughs> Check out the Easter Bunny. Isn't that the saddest looking rabbit you've ever seen? Uh, Easter bunnies aren't the only ones going bounce crazy today. Yep, so are the folks at Sky High Sports. That's where Melissa's joining us live. And yes, folks, she is in heels. Heels. No, I'm not. No, I, you guys, I changed. I'm now in this fabulous bunny costume so that I can do lots of stunts. Oh, Would good. you like to see me dressed up yeah. and doing stunts? Okay, sure. ready? On your mark, yes. go. Look at Look this. Look go. Wow, you did a Wait, flip. how are you talking and flipping at the same time? She's good. You are good. <laughs> okay. Yes, wow. you got more like me wow. right there. No, <laughs> Uh, does your pet have what it takes to be a star? Cadbury USA is searching for its next spokes animal. Any pet can try out. Uh, there's a photo and a video submission component to the contest. Some owners show off their furry friend in ears, hats, or other costumes. Uh, the winner will be the new Cadbury. Uh, you gotta help me with this. Say that word. Clucking. Clucking bunny. I, I was afraid I was gonna say something bad. <laughs> bunny commercial and receive a five thousand dollar cash prize the deadline to enter is march 1st last year's winner lieutenant dan will serve as a guest judge the winner will be announced on march 23rd i was really afraid i was gonna misspeak and say something really bad on tv and get into a lot of trouble it's all so, right we're on a we're on a five second delay are we <laughs> yeah i don't know i can't confirm that I don't think we are. <laughs> yeah, we are said not. Nope. And, uh, and that is in fact I not true, Marcus. I'd like to have a job at the end of the night, Marcus. See you so. on YouTube, Phil. Yep. <laughs> Over at CTV Morning Live, their mission is to mash up news and Easter at the same time, which isn't easy. That it is all in good fun, and we're continuing the fun right now all morning long. Look at these ears. All morning long, Katrin and I have been trying to get you ready for Easter, and now we're going to do a little bunny <laughs> toss. These are inflatable ears. This is the bunny. Yes, correct. I'm the tosser. This is from the dollar store in case anyone wants to try this at home. <laughs> but Katrin's going to try <laughs> land these inflatable oh, rings. Okay, I'm going to try to do this. I take ring tossing very seriously, so you're gonna wanna launch back. This is gonna be better than my curling video. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> oh! Oh my gosh, we almost got that one. Okay. Hop a little like harder, Alex, okay? Harder? Like higher. That's what I said. <laughs> Sorry, I was confusing it with curling. <laughs> Hurry hard! Hurry hard. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That was the closest. Okay, we got to collect. Okay, regroup, things. regroup, regroup. Clean up. That was really clean up on aisle twelve. Okay. That was a warm up. We got this. Okay, here we go. Okay, one. Katrin, two. you're out yeah. of frame. Oh, sorry, sorry. I'm too focused on the athletics of this. <laughs> <laughs> athletics is a very loose term for anything I do. Okay. <laughs> Okay. This, oh, 
Okay. Every time I'm so close. I hope this is on at someone's like <laughs> dentist's office on mute. <laughs> and it's just very confusing. Just us hopping around, no sound. <laughs> like, what are they doing? You don't need to know. You know? Me, okay, one last round. I'm We're thinking. not out of breath at all, right? Now. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was a loud scream. Sorry. Sorry, audio. <sighs> Katrin, come on. Maybe it's you. You're not you. even trying. Maybe you. Should... I'm standing still. Maybe it's you. You're the bunny here. <laughs> <laughs> right. So it's definitely me. Okay. Easter Sunday, about as good as an Easter Sunday forecast could be. Mid to upper 40s for the sunrise services at 6.56 in the morning and mid 70s by Easter afternoon. Dinner outside. Oh, wait a second. <laughs> he can't do that up here. They can be up here, but that, okay. That I should have put the dance. You, you got to stop that, Maura. <laughs> All right, let's go to this. <laughs> Speaking of babies, we want to congratulate Channel 10 photo journalist Joe Baker and his wife, Colby, on the birth of their daughter. How about it? Oh, Stella. look, she's beautiful. Good golly, look at her. She was born yesterday, weighing in at 8 pounds, 12 ounces. <laughs> this is some action going up on in here. And congratulations, Joe, and we're so excited for you. <laughs> we will announce the third rabbit's name in nine months. <laughs> Have a terrific day and a great Easter. That was a first. You know, I was trying to get the Easter Bunny to come over and help me do the weather, but, you know, she, she, or he just won't even hop along, you know. Oh, you, you spoke too soon. I don't know. You know enough for level disturbance hopping. is trying to move out of the area. It will slowly creep out. And, oh, the bunny, the bunny is hopping into the picture. What do I know, huh? Oh, can you, can you point your ears at this thing and get it out of here? No, no, just like this. Let me show you. <laughs> now, if, you if, 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 if you just look at the look at the map. Come on, come on. You got. You, you're good at hopping, aren't you? Sure. <laughs> and if you move the ears like this, you just push the thing out of here. <laughs> oh well, you know. See, it's leaving. It is leaving. The bunny the made it leave. Yeah, had a. Had a Thank you so much, Easter Bunny. Oh, thank you very much, Easter Bunny, because that's what everybody wanted to see after yesterday. I'll tell you that. <laughs> very dangerous weather, of course, we had in the area. And the bunny just hopped it on out of here. Meanwhile, anchor Bianca Peters and meteorologist Matt Jordan are busy with an Easter challenge of their own. Matt, we love the little jumping bunny that you put yeah, in Yeah, I like there. to put that in there. So yeah. festive, so yeah. festive. I'll try. All right, well, Easter is, of course, just a few days away, and we like to celebrate the real meaning of Easter, but it's not Easter without peeps, right? That is so true. <laughs> right? They That's didn't tell me staple. anything about this. I don't so. know anything about this either. Okay, <laughs> so these two are going to have a little peep chubby bunny challenge. If you guys have, you've heard of the chubby no, bunny I have no idea what challenge. That is. You try to stuff your mouth with, uh, you know better. Go yes. ahead. You yeah, just yeah you it. put one in your mouth, you have to say chubby bunny, and you keep going until you can't say it. The winner gets to take home... I don't know. Gets the right, to eat, the gets to eat them. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So no choking. Please okay, be careful. I'm that. here to I'll help stay, I'll in stay case, conscious while in we're case here. something. She does have the Heimlich maneuver. One maneuvers, little so. good smack on the back <laughs> or something CPR. like that. Yeah, I got and, it. and moral support. Okay. Um, who, who's going to start? We'll do it at the same time. Let's go. Okay. First Peep one. Number one. Oh, and these are flavored. And there's a method to this. A what? Oh, a method. Oh, a met. She already can't talk. Okay. Chubby bunny. Chubby bunny. Okay. Okay. Number two. Going to obviously that. Chubby bunny. That's good. Okay. <laughs> oh, She's chubby bunny. <laughs> <laughs> Why did your voice get so high? <laughs> Got an accent, all of a sudden. Okay. Ew, number three. Oh. Don't do that. Don't do that. Can you say it? Chubby bunny. Oh yeah, we'll take that. <laughs> <laughs> Come oh, on, yeah. Bianca. He can't. Don't let him show you. <laughs> I don't know if it's because she's laughing or because her mouth is full. I think Matt just... No way! That's not going to work. It counts? Okay, our director says it counts. Continue. Okay. Come on, come on. They're just going to say it's put more on the mouth. Exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Matt, can you do it? <laughs> Bianca. 
<laughs> I'm getting the grossest view over here, by the way, you guys. Yours should be thankful she's covering her mouth in the front. <laughs> 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 I think they're done. You can't do any more? Okay, okay. Well, uh, no, I'm really good. I'm really good. All right. We'll be back after this break. David told me, I'm going to surprise you tonight in the news. And that is when I knew I was scared. But this wasn't as bad as I thought. Hey, it's great yeah. stuff, right? I mean, happy Easter. <laughs> Good morning, Tennessee, and a very happy Easter to all of you. We're waking up to some dense fog on the plateau, a little bit of frost too, but other than that, the morning, very, very calm. We're seeing those clouds decrease from west to east as well, so tons of sunshine, especially by the early afternoon. Mid-50s by midday, and then by 5 p.m., we're going to be in the upper 60s, so a lot warmer than yesterday, and at least we've got the sunshine on our side as well, with even more sunshine from Monday to Tuesday and Wednesday. Temperatures getting closer to 80, though. I don't know what you're thinking. Where, where is that bouncing bunny? <laughs>